Good morning, everybody. I'm Julie Moran. Welcome back to Mission Makeover on this very special edition of The Balancing Act. We're at our halfway point in the ladies' journey. Oh my gosh, some dramatic stuff last week. Unfortunately, Jill Tracy was discharged from the show. Plus, our two remaining ladies had their own reality check. Now we've got a new team member as we kick off week six of our Mission Makeover series. How do they expect a big girl like me to do push-ups? This is a moment of change, so it's not gonna feel comfortable, but you guys are doing it. Can I give up? This is gonna be a journey we're all gonna go on together. And welcome back to the Balancing Act's Mission Makeover Series. With just six weeks left, our newest team member, Brenda Selner, oh boy, she has her work cut out for her. But this realtor on the go, she's ready to go for it. Today, I'm looking forward to meeting the ladies for the first time. I know they've been at it for a while and I need to get up to speed. Hello, ladies. Hey. Hi. Here's Brenda and she's very excited to be here and she is definitely ready to commit to the whole experience. Right there, rotate a little bit more and keep your knees steady right where they need to be, go ahead. I'm excited for her. I think that, you know, this is a good opportunity and if you can take advantage of it, it's a great thing. Good morning, Rosa, how are you? Good morning, Brenda, how are you today? Well, my job as a realtor is really something that I hold dear. It's a service job. I've been doing it for over 25 years. What a great idea. Wonderful idea to do a mailing. I'm trying to keep myself competitive, relevant, and up to date in my industry. My peers, they're younger than I am. I respect them, but I want to be competitive with them. Can you guess my age? I'm actually 70. Hello, this is Brenda, can I help you? It's more than just a weight loss, it's a matter of getting toned and getting in shape and strength. I think I'm pretty healthy, but I do have high blood pressure, hypertension. I'm told that if I get my weight down, there's a good chance that that could absolutely go away. And my ZRT testing confirms this. Dr. Conlon did tell me my cortisol levels are elevated thanks to stress, but diet, exercise, and taking supplements will help my adrenal recovery and stress levels. I love my occasional wine in the evening. Red, white, Shiraz, Merlot, and Champagne. <laughs> what time is it? Oh, I think it's time for a glass of wine. Oh, I think that's the best time of the day. You know, they, they say the 70 is the new 50, so. Yeah, that, I saw that on TV somewhere. Here's to my success. Success. And you coming in alongside me and in being supportive, I do appreciate that. Thank you. A little bit later, we'll find out Brenda's official stats and if Blanca has dropped anything from last week's 201 pounds or if Alex has slimmed down from 240 pounds. Coming up, starting the day off right with a healthy smoothie. That sounds so good. But first, a healthy eating tip from our friends at Domino Sugar with chef Nick Stellino. Hello, it's so nice to meet you ladies. You must be so proud of yourself and I know you've been learning so many great tips both about eating and the fitness along the way. And I thought we'd discuss healthy snacking today. How do you like that? Oh, good, good idea, we all love our snacks. I thought you would like that. And if you're going to snack, and many of us do, even while on a health journey, you must do it right. This morning, we are going to prepare an incredible snack. Light candied spice nuts. All you need is ground cinnamon nutmeg, chili powder, water, mixed nuts, salty, and of course the good tasting Domino or CNH light sugar and stevia blend. And don't let the word candy in the recipe title fool you. We are using Domino or CNH light which is an all natural sugar blend with half the calories and carbohydrates of sugar. In a microwave safe bowl or an oven safe ceramic bakeware combine Domino or CNH light with spices. Stir in water, with a wooden spoon. Microwave uncovered on high for one minute. Stir, add nuts mixing until well coated. Microwave an additional three to four minutes, stirring the mixture after each minute. Spread the nuts evenly onto a lightly greased aluminum foil lined baking sheet to cool completely. And voila, 
here is a finished dish. Dig in, ladies. Oh, Check it out. Good. I love yeah. nuts. Oh. Well, especially sweet. Oh my God! I think it's fantastic the mm. way they it's take. So I knew you would love that. Enjoy it and keep up the great work. I'm looking forward to see you next time. Like us on Facebook at The Balancing Act and tell us how you're making your own makeover story at home. Welcome back, everybody, to the Balancing Act's Mission Makeover Series. You know, breakfast truly is the most important meal of the day. And unfortunately, most of us just rush out the door without eating, which can lead to a slippery slope when it comes to the rest of the day. One option that's quick and easy, that's a smoothie. They even work for lunch or a healthy snack, replacing bad choices with good ones. Well, today we're supposed to learn how to make smoothies um, to not only, like, enhance your diet, but also like as meal replacements. So that sounds like an on-the-go mom kind of great idea. Good morning, ladies. Good morning. Good morning. I'm Lori Chapman from Right Size Health and Nutrition. Right Size Smoothies have 15 grams of protein and six grams of fiber. And what that does for you is it makes you feel full. It's so delicious, you feel like you're really cheating on a diet because it has such a decadent taste. The flavor combinations are virtually unlimited. Our website has over 100 different recipes. So there's something for breakfast, something for lunch, an indulgent snack. Do I start with the fruits or am I gonna put the powder in first? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter, whatever's most convenient. This is something that's like very quick. And now I can just drink it right out of here? Exactly, and that's what I do. I make it in the morning and take the cup in the car with me and drink it on my way to work. Okay, that's really good. Is that good? Yeah, yeah it really is. We also did a recent clinical trial where participants who replaced two meals a day with a right-sized smoothie and also had a reduced calorie diet lost on average of 15 to 18 pounds in 12 weeks. Mm. Wow, that's really good. That's, that's great yeah. incentive. Boy, that's healthy looking. <laughs> Mm -hmm. And Lori, we're using chili powder, but I would imagine you could use a variety of spices uh, yeah. that are com what you feel that would go with uh, a, a, a lunchtime mm -hmm. savory mix. Absolutely. And this is uh, tea. Mm hmm. Green tea. And the powder. There you go. There you go. I like smoothies because they're versatile. You can add any type of fruit, you can add vegetables. You get a protein with it. It's very healthy. It's delicious. It doesn't taste like vegetables. Uh -huh. It tastes like a, a milkshake. Fresh fruit is great, but when it's not in season, frozen fruit is a great alternative. For the base smoothies, when they're made with eight ounces of skim milk, it comes to 180 calories that's per meal. Amazing. That's not bad. No. And a then meal. whatever you add in the fruit. Exactly. I mean, I mean that's, fruit. That's you know. Me, I've been vegetables too. Exactly. That's awesome. This is the chocolate covered strawberry flavor, which is one of our most popular flavors. Oh yeah, that's a chocolate covered strawberry. <laughs> is that good? Is that good? Oh yeah, I'm happy right about now. <laughs> Here's a little something for you. Wow. And we wish you the best in your weight loss journey. Oh, that's Thank awesome. you. Thank you so Thank much. You. So wow, much. that's great. You're welcome. Getting enough sleep and learning how to de-stress our daily stresses are crucial when it comes to our health and well-being. Note to self, note to self. Well, indeed, a stress-deprived, sleep-deprived body certainly can't repair itself after exercise, as Dr. Bob Marshall explains. Ladies. Hey, Dr. Bob. Nice so to good see to see you. See you. Yes. And nice to meet you. You're just joining now. That's it's great. Nice to meet you. I heard wonderful things about you. We are a little stressed out these days. Feeling stressed? Yeah. Well, why don't we sit down and talk about that? Okay, okay? cool. Well, ladies, uh, you're feeling a little stressed, a little grumpy, maybe a little tired. Yeah. Well, you're both at kind of a different phase. Okay. Maybe we can do a few things to promote more energy and make you feel stronger. So I think the one, the number one thing we should do is take a look at B vitamins. And what we want is a living source, something that came from food at one time. And we want it to be in the fully methylated form so it's ready to use by the cell. And now small amounts have the kick of a mule. They really can promote energy by helping you to burn and use your food instead of storing it as fat. 
And so here is one of the best forms and just a very small amount in your food um, will make all the difference in the world. So it's in your food, not on your tongue? You can put or... it in your food, you can make it into a drink, any way that's convenient for you. Now we're gonna talk a little bit about sleep because this is so important to getting through an exercise regimen, getting ideal weight, and without sleep, you can't have good health. And uh, really one of the major uh, issues here is going into REM sleep. If we're not getting this REM sleep, we wake up, even though we slept through the night, and we still feel tired. Wow, it's pretty hard to exercise like that. So we have a combination of two herbs, Sisyphus and Magnolia, that have been shown to uh, promote a neurotransmitter reset in the brain. It sometimes takes seven to 10 days to really kick in. Now, this is melatonin. This is a liquid, so you would just take one or two or three drops under the tongue in this case, and you would do it shortly before sleep. This is probiotic generated melatonin, so it's very clean, very easy to use. I've been taking um, the supplements, and uh, I have to tell you, it really does make a huge difference. I don't have to take the, my medication anymore. Uh, for sleep, which was a big issue for me. I'm falling asleep quick. I'm staying asleep a solid eight hours. And for me, that's golden. Like, that's a huge win. One thing that even compounds the benefit of sleep has been extra magnesium. And I particularly like magnesium glycinate. The magnesium glycinate at 500 milligrams has been shown to uh, promote favorable expression of over 20 genes that regulate weight loss. It also tends to make it easier for the intestines, for your bowel movements, and uh, a deeper sleep yet. We got great information today, you know. We're gonna go finish our walk. Would you care to join us? Great, love Let's to. Let's go. Oh, there's nothing better than a good night's sleep, and I'm always looking for new sleep tips. But no dozing yet. We've got more to come, including time-saving tactics for the family meal. And right now, here's my good friend, fitness guru, and P90X creator, Tony Horton, with some motivational words of wisdom. Go, Tony. Every day, every workout, and every meal gives you a chance to improve your life. The early stages of this transformation can be a bumpy road, but that's true for most people, so don't fret when it doesn't go according to plan. The journey to improve my life, well, it had plenty of ups and downs, and when I first started learning how to exercise and eat better, <laughs> I loved sugar and fried foods, but they were killing me and I didn't know it. When it came to exercise, I never trained properly, so playing sports was often a disaster for me. I was lucky though because in my late 20s, I began to hang around some fun, smart people who led me to this new lifestyle. I wanted to be strong, lean, flexible, healthy, and happy, and I know you want that too. So choose to change each and every day and you will have the incredible life I know you have always wanted. Join us on Twitter at Balancing Act TV, hashtag Mission Makeover, to share your weight loss journey. Welcome back to Mission Makeover. Admit it, everybody, when time is at a premium, our eating habits suffer. We choose convenience over quality, fast over nutritious. Well, with a bit of pre-planning and preparation, the whole family can eat healthier, as the ladies learn from nutritionist David Grotto when he pays them a house call. Hi, Brenda. Hi. David Grotto, how are you? Nice to meet you, David. A pleasure to meet you as well. You're ready for your nutrition house call? Oh, yes. Mission Makeover ladies, welcome to Brenda's Kitchen. Before I start talking about individual foods, I brought your best tool in the world. This is actually a food portion plate. So what we want to do is make half of our plate fruits and vegetables, about a quarter of the plate protein, quarter of the plate greens, and then also dairy. So I have fresh fruits and vegetables here, which is fantastic, but this takes time to clean them, to prepare them, to cook them. But a lot of people actually discount these frozen vegetables. Frozen vegetables are the best kept secret. You can pop these in the microwave in minutes you've got nutritious fruits and vegetables that are as nutritious as fresh. Canned vegetables that are low sodium are just as nutritious as well. There is no such thing as a bad fruit in your program. The only caution I would give you is that sometimes the portion sizes can get away. So if you're looking at about a cup of fruit, that's only 50 calories. I mean, that's great having about three servings of that a day. So let's get some grains. Here's some pasta. 
There's some couscous. We've got some instant brown rice, and then we have fingerling potatoes. I have a question about the pasta. Is there such a big difference health-wise with whole wheat and um, regular pasta? Well, from a calorie perspective, there is no difference. But from a nutrition standpoint, fiber is a really key point that I want to get across here. People who eat higher fiber diets usually manage their weight and keep their weight down. Uh, of course, you know, one of the main emphasis that we have here today is about convenience and time. This all takes some time to put together, but you could have a cooking day where you prepare your pasta ahead of time. Cooked pasta will last in the refrigerator for about three days. It's time to talk protein. Delicious. Now you're talking. Now we're talking. We've got the rotisserie yeah. chicken. Got some low sodium ham, which is a very cool thing. So rotisserie chicken, you can go ahead and pick up one fairly inexpensively and you can get multiple meals out of it. This is a low fat, low calorie Alpine Swiss cheese, which is fantastic. It's only 50 calories per slice. Then of course, in my book, The Best Things You Can Eat, salmon is one of the foods that appears most in the list in the books. One of the good reasons to eat it frequently is because it's rich in something called omega-3 fats. And omega-3 fats have been shown to help fight heart disease, diabetes. The other the last thing I wanted to show are these wonderful fruit cups that are packed in water. Again, it's about convenience. You can already get the fruit. It's already portion controlled. You're looking at about 60, 70 calories per cup. That's fantastic. It'd be great for you. All right, ladies, we covered a lot of material today, and I think you've got a good groundwork for a healthy diet. But just to make sure that you do have some information you can call back on, I want to give you each a copy of my new book. So, woo, mission makeover. Let's have a nice high five. Thank you. Thank, <laughs> Thank you. you. And here you go. Thank you. And Thanks. enjoy and have a healthy life. Okay, some of those tips are definitely going in my weekly routine. Don't go away, we're coming right back. Well, that's our show, but make sure to join us next week. I surprise the ladies with a secret weapon. And how are you doing on your own personal mission makeover? I want you to tell us all about it on Facebook and follow us on Twitter. Okay, let's take a look now at the ladies' stats. Alexandra began her journey at 242 pounds. She is up three pounds this week for a total gain of one pound. Her body mass index is now 41.7, but she has lost 10 inches. Blanca started her journey at 220 pounds. She has lost five pounds this week for a total loss of 24 pounds. Her BMI is now 32.1. Total inches lost, 16. And Brenda starts officially at 184 pounds with a BMI of 32.7. No inches yet to report. We'll see you next Monday on another special edition of Mission Makeover. And remember, every Monday, you'll be able to see back-to-back -back episodes of the show. Thanks so much for watching, everybody. I'm Julie Moran. So long. Mission Makeover is sponsored by Domino Light and CNH Light, all natural sugar and stevia blend, the lightweight to do sweet.